Laurel Hubbard is a New Zealand weightlifter, selected to compete at the 2020 Summer Olympics. She will be the first transgender athlete to compete in the Olympic Games after transitioning. Hubbard is the child of Dick Hubbard, a former mayor of Auckland City and the founder of Hubbard Foods. Competing before her gender transition, Hubbard set New Zealand junior records in 1998 in the newly established M105 Plus division with snatch. 135 kg, clean and jerk 170 kg, total 300 kg. Those records were later surpassed by David Leite. In 2012 Hubbard transitioned to female and became Laurel Hubbard. At the 2017 Australian International and Australian Open in Melbourne, she competed at the heaviest 90 kg plus category. Winning the gold medal with a 123 kg snatch and 145 kg clean and jerk. For a total of 268 kg at a body weight of 131.83 kg. She thus became the first trans woman to win an international weightlifting title for New Zealand. Although Hubbard met eligibility requirements to compete, her win sparked controversy with some other competitors claiming the competition was unfair. Athletes that were critical of the decision to allow Hubbard to compete include Ianya Sipaya, Tofutu Periv, Deborah Akasson and Tracy Lambrex. Australian Weightlifting Federation's chief executive, Michael Keelan, said it was unfair to other competitors. Hubbard qualified for the 2018 Commonwealth Games, but an elbow injury during the competition forced her withdrawal from the event while leading the field. Hubbard won two gold medals at the 2019 Pacific Games in Samoa. The decision to allow Hubbard to compete was subsequently criticized by the Samoa 2019 chairman, Lo Sola Male Malo Kennedy CEO, and Samoa's Prime Minister, Tulaipa Iono Shalile Malialegoi. In 2020 she won the gold medal in the women's plus 8-7 kg event at the Roma 2020 World Cup in Rome. Italy. On 21 June 2021, the New Zealand Olympic Committee confirmed that Hubbard had been selected for the New Zealand Olympic team to compete in the women's 87kg category. This decision resulted in Hubbard becoming the first openly transgender athlete to be selected for the Olympic Games. The decision attracted controversy, with Belgian weightlifter Anna van Bellingheim claiming that allowing a transgender woman to compete in the women's event was unfair in that the situation was, like a bad joke. The selection was also criticised by the former New Zealand representative athlete Tracy Lambrex. Others, including competitor Charisma Amotarant, supported Hubbard's participation. In January 2019, Hubbard pleaded guilty to careless driving causing injury after an incident in October 2018 which left another driver with severe spinal injuries. She paid reparations and was disqualified from driving for one month. The presiding judge also ordered that Hubbard's name be suppressed to avoid distressing publicity. As she trained for the Olympics. However, the order was lifted in July 2019 after the media company staff appealed to the High Court.